We found Senator Richard Luger at the White House, departing after a meeting with the President. For Luger, the memories of September 11, 2001 are still fresh. I was in the, my office in the Hart Building when the windows rattled. I thought that uh, an attack had occurred on the U.S. Capitol. Of course, it was the Pentagon that was attacked. One month later, Luger learned of the next attack when the air conditioning shut down in his Capitol Hill office. Anthrax had been discovered on the floor below. The war really came right to the office, literally. And, and it was enclosed in gloom for 96 days, almost as if nothing had, had happened. Senator Luger has spent years warning of the threat of terrorism and the potential for an attack on American soil. Yet even he couldn't imagine the attack that took place on September 11. Luger always suspected that terrorists would acquire nuclear weapons in a scenario that was played out in campaign ads during his abbreviated run for president in 1996. We're not uh, out of the woods yet with regard to those scenarios. Now Luger is sharing his foreign policy expertise and his concerns about terrorism, not only with the president, but with others from here to Russia. Here he takes part in an interview with Canadian television. We are vulnerable. We are a country that uh, is envied by everybody. We are the country that has the possibility of leading, bringing more freedom, uh, but uh, not without a lot of cost. And I suspect now we, we understand we will not be left alone.